Welcome. Thank you for joining us for the 37th annual Focus on Children Conference. My name is Jen Knudsen, and I am the Child and Family Studies Program Manager here at Bellingham Technical College and coordinator for this event. This year may look and feel a bit different, but our commitment to providing high quality professional development for early learning professionals in our state remains the same. While we miss connecting with you here on BTC's campus in Settlemeyer Hall, we believe that today's program will not disappoint. I would like to begin by acknowledging that many of us stand today on the ancestral homelands of the Coast Salish peoples who have lived in the Salish Sea Basin throughout the San Juan Islands and the North Cascades watershed since time immemorial. Please join me in expressing our deepest respect and gratitude for our indigenous neighbors, the Lummi Nation and Nooksack Tribe, for their enduring care and protection of our shared lands and waterways. If it were not for the historic and continued commitment from our Coast Salish neighbors to preserving these lands, we, as a community and organization, would not be able to benefit from the lush, vibrant landscape we live, work, learn, and play in today. Today's program includes a keynote address given by Miriam Abdullah, PhD of the Greater Good Science Center, followed by a small group discussion. We will then have a short break from 1030 to 1045. Prior to 1045, pl please log in to the second Zoom link that was sent in your confirmation email, as this will take you directly to your first breakout session. This session will end at 1245, and we will come back together after lunch at 1.30 for our third and final breakout session. Please use the third Zoom link to log into this session anytime prior to 1.30. As a friendly reminder, please mute yourself during the presentations so that our attendees can have the highest quality experience possible. During discussion portions, it is best if you stay muted unless you are talking. Video is highly recommended unless you are having trouble with your connection, which can be helped by turning your video off. Please make sure that your name that is being displayed on Zoom is the name that you registered with. You can edit your name by clicking on participants and finding your name, hovering over your name, and clicking more, and then rename. This will help us in tracking attendance as well as if you have any technical difficulties. We can assist you more quickly. If you do have technical difficulties during today's event, please email helpdesk at btc.edu, you'll find the link in the chat, or call 360-752-8448. Many of you also would like to earn stars or clock hours for your attendance at today's event. Normally, we're able to approve stars and clock hours based on sign-in sheets and in-person evaluation forms. For today's conference, we will be approving STARS and clock hour requests based on evaluations that are completed after the conference on our Canvas page. We'll be putting a link to our Canvas page as well as instructions on how to log in in the chat. The best thing to do is to click on this link when you see it in the chat so that the Canvas page will pop up and you'll be all set to complete the evaluation after the conference ends. You can also find Canvas information in your confirmation email or the confirmation conference, conference website. Lastly, I would like to thank our sponsors. Whatcom Early Learning Alliance is a collaboration of organizations dedicated to supporting access to high quality early learning opportunities for all children and their families. The Pacific Northwest chapter of WIAC is an organization who acts on behalf of the needs and rights of all young children and their families and provides opportunities to improve professional practice in early childhood education. Bellingham Technical College, providing student-centered, high-quality, professional technical education for today's needs and tomorrow's opportunities. Opportunity Council, a private, nonprofit human service organization that acts as a catalyst for positive change both in the community and in the lives of the people it serves. The Opportunity Council has also joined forces 
with the Bellingham Regional Chamber of Commerce to open the Center for Retention and Expansion of Child Care. I am excited to welcome Abigail and Kenda from the Center to tell us more. Hi, I'm Abigail Tankersley. And I'm Kenda Sitma. We're the team that operates the Center for Retention and Expansion of Child Care Northwest, also known as CREC Northwest. Like many of you, we were hoping to be in person for this amazing conference focused on children. Ideally, we would have an information table set up, we would have the opportunity to meet you all face to face and answer any of your questions on the spot. However, as you all know, the pandemic has hindered that, but we are not going to let that stop us. So here we are virtually to tell you more about what CREC can do for you. First, a brief history. In 2020, pre-pandemic, Opportunity Council and the Bellingham Regional Chamber of Commerce joined forces to open the new CREC Northwest. Here at CREC Northwest, we're laser focused on retaining and expanding child care in Island, San Juan, Skagit, Snohomish, and Whatcom counties. To do that, we partner with city and county leaders, housing and commercial real estate developers, employers, large and small, nonprofits, and of course, childcare providers. The pandemic will end. We need to sustain providers until then, and we have to end the childcare desert that previously existed. Recently, due to the difficult times COVID-19 has created for childcare, we have spent a lot of time focusing on sustaining the childcare industry by advocating for and facilitating grant funding. Since opening early last spring, we have facilitated grants to over 62 providers, including both family childcare and childcare centers. We have more resources to use going forward. We work with all providers. For those of you enrolled in Early Achievers, we work hand in hand with your Early Achievers coaches to help support you in the many aspects of childcare and together find solutions for your current needs. So are you a family child care provider looking to expand into a center? Are you a center looking to grow and add a second location? Do you want to move within counties or expand to another county? Do you know someone who's interested in opening a new facility? Do you wish there was a service that helped with some of the administrative or back office functions of your business? Or are you ready to retire but want your life's work to continue with someone else? We are here to help. We are collaborative and well-connected within multiple communities. We want to support those who choose the childcare profession to be successful. How can we help you? You can reach us at CREC Northwest at, by emailing childcarebiz at opco.org. That's childcarebiz at opco.org. Or just talk to your early achievers coach. We hope you enjoy the great lineup of speakers and workshops ahead of you during the 2021 Focus on Children virtual conference. Thank you. We hope to hear from you soon. Thank you. Thank you so much, Abigail and Kenda, and we are excited for all the ways that the Center for Retention and Expansion of Child Care will contribute to our early learning community. Before we begin, I would also like to thank a few key individual BTC employees. Without their time and dedication, this event would not have been possible. Heidi Wilbrandt, Melissa Mejia, Curtis Pereira, Craig Perry Olila, Sebastian Schulz, Bonita Chiono, Chris Flack, and Marnie Sailing Mayer. I would also like to thank the Focus Committee for their ongoing support and brilliant ideas, which guided the formation of today's event. Without further ado, I would like to welcome and introduce our keynote speaker. Mariam Abdullah, PhD. Ms. Abdullah is the Parenting Program Director at UC Berkeley's Greater Good Science Center. She is a developmental psychologist with expertise in parent-child relationships and children's pro-social development. At the Greater Good Science Center, Mariam leads the Center's Parenting Initiative, which supports community-based organizations that serve parents. She also writes articles about the latest child development and parenting science research for families. Prior to joining the Greater Good Science Center, she was an assistant project scientist in the Department of Pediatrics at the University of California, Irvine. 
where she conducted applied research with children and families and provided parenting and child interventions at a school-based behavioral health program. Today, she will be presenting practical, science-based ways to help realize our own capacity for compassion for our community and ourselves. Please join me in welcoming Mariam Abdullah. 